what if the horse is infused with light, right? So what if we actually have to find a way to kill the horse to get the crystal? Would that be brilliant? That would be brilliant. Be sheer brilliance. Hello everybody and welcome back to my little blacksmith shop. My name is Twister and today we're gonna try and find the fourth crystal. So we have three crystals so far. We have two of them at the altar. Nothing has happened yet, but I have a feeling it might happen soon. I haven't seen you in here before, have I? Can I talk to you, my friend? I cannot. These guys are gonna be in the next update. They're gonna be the so-called heroes who will have special requests and whatnot. Gonna be a very big part of the game. So we want to find the old golem and want to find the shield and spear we had over here somewhere. We can actually do that. Cause if that's still in the game, I don't know if it is. Because that's where the last crystal was before. We seem to have reached the edge of the map. Oh no. It's where the cave is, right? So there's nothing here. Was this some stuff? You know, it's not like a secret entrance maybe, but no dice. Maybe like an invisible wall somewhere? Uh, I mean a walk throughable wall? No, no dice. No, Alright, let's go back into the forest a bit. I don't think we gave this uh, area its fair shake. But if it's not here, it's gotta be somewhere, right? Because we have... We're missing the light... The... Was it the courage crystal? It was some kind of crystal. It had a name. There were two nameless crystals and two named crystals. It was the crystal of... I think it was the Crystal of Fear and Crystal of Courage that were named. I could be totally wrong though. It's been a while. It's been like a like two, three months since the last played. What is that over there? You saw that, right? Something blue. Oh, that's just I just came back. Okay. Oh, you see this? Why is this so bright? Is this a clue? No, it's just a shadow. God damn it, shadow! I thought I could trust you. All right, so I don't think there's anything in this area of the forest. So I'm gonna go all the way to the edge of the map. More floating rocks, that's awesome. I'm gonna try exploring a little bit more. Because the crystal has gotta be somewhere, just haven't found it yet. Again, there's not that many videos up on the uh, on YouTube right now, because this when I'm playing this right now, it's only available to people who are donators. And I'm a, I'm a donator on, on itch. So I got the game a little bit early. So I can't actually go this way, this is blocked off, an invisible wall. There's the altar. There's like a weird wonky tree here. I'm gonna walk over here on this side. Maybe there's something behind this building. This feels a little bit too close to the lake, right? I don't, if, I don't think it's gonna be that close to this location. There's nothing over there because that's an area you cannot actually get to. So we're safe in that regard. Can we climb over here on this little hill? We can. Can't go this way. It's all blocked off. Okay, this is obviously missing some stuff, so I don't want to go there. No, no, no. Oh, no. Okay, this is all blocked off. You're now underwater. No! I'm gonna get back up easily. Takes a while to swim. But that's perfectly mighty fine. I don't really mind. Let's move it along. Should be back home in no time. Actually, I want to go behind this house. To the big house and then on the other side of the forest. Just gotta get out of these stupid lilies. Come on. All right. I know it's hidden somewhere because they're they, they wouldn't just remove a crystal, right? There were four of them. They were a massive mystery. They gotta be somewhere. They gotta be hiding. Maybe on this hill, but I already checked this, didn't I? I think I checked this in the first episode. Yeah, there was nothing here, just a dead end. Also, I think we might hear the crystal when we come close to it, because this is one of those crystals that makes noise. Okay, actually, I, I can go down here, and I don't wanna, because that's gonna be really bad. If we fall off the map, I don't know if there's a way to actually get back. So I don't wanna risk it. Uh, we cannot actually enter this area, this is completely blocked off. We can try maybe, maybe in the crates here? we get the crates? We cannot touch the crates here. You, my friend, are 
a kind of cleric. You have a book, maybe a paladin type deal thing. Uh, this is not for sale yet. You cannot enter this one. It's gonna be the future blacksmith shop. The bigger one with two floors. Oh! It's something. I heard something. Like a little... Noisy noise. No, this is just an invisible wall. I can't actually go here. Alright, so let's just walk along the invisible wall, see how far we can get. I and mean, there's gotta be something, right? There's gotta be... It has to be somewhere, man. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, there's just a lamp. Oh, my lord. I got so excited for a second. Oh. Okay, well, I'm not stuck, thankfully. So I was stuck there for a second. No, this was it, but it's just a lamp. What over here? Again, a dead end. It's got, I think it's gotta be in this area now, right? That whole little thing in the wood seems to be gone. But the crystal has to be somewhere. Oh, it's getting kind of dark here. We can actually access the area, so it actually might be over here. Nope, another invisible wall. God damn it. And this is where the cave is, right? Up here. This is the cave, right? Oh, this is new music. We haven't heard this music so far. That might be a sign. Oh, we can go over here. Oh, we can go over here. Never mind. Man, is there really no crystal of light? Where is the crystal of light, guys? Let me know in the comments if you know. I really would need to know this. This is very important to me. I, I probably just missed it like a dummy. But I, I can't find it. It was like previously it was, I think it was over here next to this thing. There was a little thing over here. With a sword, uh, actually with a pole and a shield, and it was under the shield. But I don't see that little campsite anywhere now. <gasps> Maybe it's in the horse. What if... Oh my god. What if you actually bring the crystals to these guys? Maybe they'll do something with them. What if the horse is infused with light, right? So what if we actually have to find a way to kill the horse to get the crystal? That'd be brilliant. That would be brilliant. Be sheer brilliance. And I have to go over here. I'm not doing much blacksmithing, but I'm just intrigued by the crystal somehow. It's gotta be somewhere. I know it. It's probably just hiding in plain sight somewhere. And I can't find it. Like, have I checked around this area? I have. I haven't checked in the well. I haven't checked in the well, guys. Might be in the well. Might be in the well. No, it's not in the well. You gonna fight me? You gonna fight me? Oh my, you're actually gonna push me away. Oh my lord. I'm angry. You're not gonna fight me though. Is it hidden in this building somewhere? Maybe it's hidden inside. Maybe, maybe once we buy something from this guy, he's gonna show it to us. Maybe it's, it's, it's in the fireplace maybe. Hold on. Hello, sir. Not here. Where are you hiding the light gem? I need to know. You're hiding it from me. I know you have it somewhere. Ah! Give it to me! Give it to me! Give it to me. He doesn't want to give it to me. Is that in the well? It's not near this thing, whatever this is. It's like a useless piece of wood stuff. I don't know what it's used for at all. So it could be in my... Maybe it's just in my backyard. Maybe it's in the statue, I don't know. Let's uh, take the unknown crystal. Or to the altar. Maybe something's gonna happen if we do that. Maybe we have to earn the crystal, but I wouldn't... I can't believe they would just remove it from the game, right? Because it's been here... The four crystals have been here since version 1. They have never disappeared, they've always been here. Fear crystal, unknown crystal. No, nothing's happening still. Maybe if we use something with the altar, we get the light crystal? Because this is an altar, I guess, but I just thought it would be useful for something that are a chlor, but why would he be gone? 
Why would he remove the Dark Lord? He was such a cool secret. Gonna be some more stuff here. I don't know. Okay, let's go back to our workshop. Let's do more blacksmith arening. Let's go take a nap. And let's try killing our horse. That's gonna be my task for the day. We're gonna try to find a way to kill the horse. And if we bring the horse to the altar, can he follow us there? We probably can, honestly. He can go anywhere, right? Go to bed. Take a quick nap, Reno. Alright, let's go take a peek at our backyard. Just copper. I have. For a second there, I thought it was something good. Let's put more of the rare firewood. Just turn this on and off when needed. Probably I'll put all of these in here. While I wait, where did it go? I think it went in. Probably just went in. Maybe if we climb our house somehow, but we can't actually walk on this rock at all. Just have a bunch of bars. Let's put all the bars over here. I have to open our workshop again. We can start ordering uh, grips again, I think. Go, just move this out of the way. Put them all over here. And while we wait, let's take a peek around this statue. If it's just behind the statue, it's gonna go crazy. It's not. What if we have to climb the roof? Because we do have a ladder type thing here, but there's no way to climb it. Again, I know it is somewhere. It has to be somewhere that wouldn't just remove it for no reason. This gives me a selection. Oh. Oh. Huh. Is there a secret behind this paper? No, it doesn't be to anything. What if we burn this paper? What if you burn this? Let's let's try that. Put it in the furnace. Oh no, I, I ran out of stuff. No! I might actually made everything. So I guess they will just stack indefinitely. There's no way to lose uh, ingots. They will just get together properly. Now burn it next time we have some stuff. Let's try messing with the horse. So yeah, he is infused with light. Obviously. So he has the light crystal inside him. What if we make a sword? Let's make a sword, guys. Let's make a sword. Let's uh, make a sword. We can probably equip the sword, is my guess. I hope we can. In, in the room? Is it hidden in my house? Like above, above me somewhere? <gasps> is that it? No, it's not just the light. It's such high hopes. Let's make a small sword. I'm gonna make a blade. I need to use a hammer. Get the sword, kill the horse. That'd be such a cool puzzle if that was actually the case. Hope it is. Okay, we need a little bit of a guard. I can guard version one. That's awesome. Okay, it needs to be attached directly to the handle, right? That's a change. Okay, go here, and then you go over here. Alright, can we equip this? It gives the equipping animation, but it doesn't actually equip it. So I'm guessing we cannot equip a sword. Alright, let's just open the shop. We spent enough time wasting our time. <laughs> Trying to find light crystal. It has to be somewhere. If you know where it is, let me know. Actually, don't let me know. Let me know if it exists. Don't tell me where it is. You could give me a hint. Like, a really subtle hint, but I want to find it for myself. You're gonna follow me anywhere, my horse, man. Can you follow me to the altar? He actually might the light... That's what we do, guys. He is the light crystal. We have to bring all the crystals to the altar. This is the final crystal. We have to do the, bring the horse to the altar. Something's gonna happen. Let's let's do it. Let's do it, guys. Come on. It's like it's all obvious. It has, even has a road. It's all the way here. Come on, horse. <gasps> it's a guy here. Avoid him. You get to the altar, my friend. I'm gonna sacrifice you to the gods. 
That would be such a cool puzzle if this is correct. Just bring everything, all the crystal. This is the last crystal. It's gotta be, because he is infused with light. What was that? Oh, someone came to my shop. It's open, right, okay. Stop. We have something here, guys. Oh. <gasps> Nothing's happening. I thought something would happen. Oh my, I thought something would actually happen right now. The horse and everything. Doesn't... Oh, it's gotta be some secret, though. It's gotta be somewhere. Alright, I give up for now. Let's go do some blacksmithing. We'll find the secrets later. It's okay. Maybe it's like in here. No, stop thinking about the crystal twisted. You're never gonna find it. It's off limits right now. You have people to serve. That's your job. You want a great sword? I don't have that. 20 seconds. Let me just cancel this because I'm never gonna do this successfully. I have a normal sword, that's okay. Let's order some more grips. How doing with cash? We have 63 bucks, that's okay. Let's order... Go back. Grips, like, one-handers. Two-handers. It's actually a lot more expensive now. A pole armor. It's a lot of money. Just for a bunch of grips. Alright, we got a big box because of the pole arm. So, it's best to order them separately. Okay. Squeeze it in. Come on. There you go. What do you want? Dagger. Okay, that's, that's doable. Um, Just put this over here and just break it. That's an awful location for it. God, it's so awful. <laughs> right, daggers are easy to make, though. And you gotta burn everything over here. Do we have all the ingots in the location? We do... I'm gonna try turning this on again. Give me some rare firewood. I know it's probably a waste to use this. I'm gonna see if something happens with the paper. Something's happening to the paper. Maybe if we get all the papers in the same location. Uh, okay, blades is what I need. Alright, gotta cool it. I don't know if it does make a difference. If they do, it's fairly insignificant. And just keep doing what I'm doing. Right, so we it's cost us ten. We're gonna actually see the exact cost later on. There's a dagger. Twenty from the dagger. It cost us seventeen plus the markup. Okay, it's actually good. How are we doing with our charisma? With the levels, we are halfway there to leveling up. Once we level up, it's gonna be a lot easier. Because we're gonna get more charisma. It's gonna be better. Is like crystal in the, in the lamps maybe? I don't know. I, I give up. I know it's somewhere, but I can't find it. It's a well-hidden secret. No one knows where it is. Alrighty, we need to sort these things again. Um, Two-handers. We'll place them over here, I guess. Polar group group's gonna go over here. It's a rare one, which is good. We need one more. One-handers gonna need more guards as well. I think it's getting too dark. Let's go to bed. I don't think it's gonna come anytime soon. Day 11 already? Oh my lord. Time flies when you're having fun, I guess. So we have 31 Baccarinos. Let's order some guards. Version 2 is 2 bucks. They're really cheap. They're actually the same thing, really. Sort of ten, six of these and six of these. That's enough. One hand sword. Actually, we had it already. Awesome. Let's just do this. Hello. Enjoy. Have fun. Thirty bucks. That cost us. Okay. We got. We got. We got money from it, right? We did. So how much is how much is ten? We need three tin ingots. It's five hundred. Okay, that's gonna be a lot of money. So I think it's best to invest in charisma for the time being. It's gonna pay off. At one point. Also, we have some more grips over here, right? Yeah, let's actually get these grips out of the crate. They were here. Again, that's not the best location, because sometimes they'll just connect themselves automatically to the item. But I don't think it's going to happen anymore, because they changed the way items are crafted. It's going to be better. 
need to sort all of these guys. One hand hammer, easy enough. I need to actually get a lot of items made. I don't need this over here. Go away, my friend. Want one hand hammer. And I run out of ingots. I gotta have to buy some ingots. Go. Just to keep us afloat. I could go mining. Again, mining is really good, but I think we want to just buy them for now. Mine's probably going to be a lot better once we have the ability to actually mine better things. Because it's better thing, better ingots, you don't have to spend the money on them, you just have them for free. So it's a huge return on your investment. You actually probably want to handle with that, right? Yeah, but my guess is that you do. There we go. Enjoy with your one hand hammer. Like 25? 30 bucks! Wait, what? Excuse me? Oh, <laughs> there we go. 31! Interesting that this paid more than the other one. I guess this was a rush bonus. Alright, charisma bonus was an extra one dollar. Zdene is the name. 54. Alright, let's order... we have a new person coming in. Let's order six copper ingots. Just like that. I just burn them all immediately. Can I actually smelt this axe head into something? Into like, back into Inga? That would be kind of cool if that's the thing you can do. I don't know, but we'll wait for that. I might as well sort some of these guards over here. This is like such a nifty little nook for these guards. I love that they added that. That wasn't here before. It's one of the new ones. As long as it doesn't fall out. Again, it's... Possible to get a lot more of them inside if you just stack them properly. I'm just like putting them in like a maniac. But it works. Oh, you want a dagger. Twisting the dagger. Gunjamed. He knows my name. That's impressive. Uh, a dagger. All right. Easy enough. We have heated ingots here. Gonna make a, a dagger. There we go. Make a nice one. No need to modify the stats, I think. I could, but I don't think we get more money for that. It's probably not relevant at the time being. There's there's a dagger, sir. On the floor. Thank you. I got... Uh, can you please scroll down? Always 20 bucks. That's okay. That's an okay number. Let's finish sorting these guards. It can be so much better once we do that. But these are just for swords. These are the only items that require guards. Thankfully, they're fairly cheap, so it's not a big deal. If they weren't cheap, it would be a pain to make swords. Since there are, it's just a little bit of extra cost for a little bit of extra profit. There we go. Awesome, it totally works. Uh, we have 22 Bocorinos. Let's try smelting this into something else. If we can even put it in here. No, we cannot. Never mind. It's not gonna happen anytime soon. Eat these up again. Not a one-hand sword, please. Gotta heat up my ingots. Again, I can't wait until we have like a large supply of weapons just waiting to be sold. Sold. I'm gonna spend a lot, a lot of time making them perfect. It's gonna be glorious. There we go. Make it a fancy blade. I didn't even check if there's any new blades here. I think they're all the same. All right, this is old. This is the first one. All right. Oh, sorry, my sir. There we go. That's a nice little copper blade. I don't have one-handed grips anymore. That's a problem. All right, let's go fix that. Grips. How many can we buy? Like three. It's okay. I should probably buy the fancy ones because they sell for more because of the percentage-based system. Go and one-handed guard. Get this, get this, and get this. Here you go, sir. Nice. Get 33 bucks for that? That feel Gucci. Yep, Deramu. Thank you, Deramu. You are a beautiful friend. I love you so much. I really do. What does this say again? Alright, that's something I know already. Anything I need over here? Anything hiding in this little nook? I don't think so. Can't get on the roof. It's okay. All right, let's do like one more order. Let's make a little bit more money. Let's see what this lady wants. Let's start heating up the metal immediately because we're gonna need it anyways, right? 
Ritz and Ack are gonna be super happy. You need a pole arm. All right, that's simple enough. So we're gonna need one of these bad boys. It's our last one. I'm so glad everyone knows my name right now. That makes me feel so much better. It literally adds to the immersion, I feel. There we go. I gotta modify the stats right now because I just want to do this quickly. Ah, right, that's a nifty pole arm. Here you go. Enjoy. Have fun with that. Level up noise. I'm gonna take more charisma. There we go. Oh, I actually opened the door now. Because I made me get the thing. Increase our sale price a bit. Alright. Uh, press P again. 35. Parts markup plus 2%. And the rush bonus is 2. Charisma bonus is 0 0.6. It's gonna add up, trust me. Especially once you get to better items. It's gonna be real good. Alright, it's getting kind of dark. I don't think... Okay, we have one last person. I'm gonna serve it and I'm gonna call it for today. Let's start up heating up the medals immediately. We want a great sword. Alright, I don't have that right now. I can make it. So we're gonna need a two-hand grip. Let's actually make it a good one. Be a good two-hand grip. Give you a two-handed guard. Let's merge these bad boys. I get all of these ingots ready for us. So there's gonna be all the ingots spent. So we can just buy new ones, or we can actually go to the mines again and mine some more. But again, it's kind of pain right now because we just have copper. It's going to be a lot better once we actually have the ability to get better ores. For example, tin. Because copper, it's actually not expensive to buy. We can easily do that. But other things, they make much more of a difference. There we go. There's a great sword. Enjoy. It's on the floor. 49 bucks. Oh my lord. 126 charisma bonus. It adds up, guys. I don't know how this actually makes any mathematical sense. So it's like 42 is the total for the items, right? 42 is the markup. That's 46.2. 48.2. I guess it does make sense. It just rounds it up down a bit. It doesn't round up? That's kind of annoying. I wish it would round up. It would make a little bit more sense. Alrighty, I think... Now ah, one more person coming. I guess it's okay. It's not even 10 p.m. I think they stopped coming at 10 p.m. Actually, no, we don't have any items. Sorry. I'm gonna close the shop. <laughs> we don't have any ingots. We need to buy more. We have a hundred bucks. That's actually really good. We can buy a ton of ingots tomorrow and invest them into expanding our shop. We could go mining again, but I think we should try and focus on getting a tin pickaxe because it's gonna allow us to get a lot more things done. So yeah, I'm going to actually just end this video here. If you guys enjoyed, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment. It helps us a great deal. More than you can even imagine. But yeah. Once again, thank you guys very much for watching. My name has been Twisted from Honey Bunny Games. Now we'll see you next time.